okay, so this is a terrible problem. If I try to command P, you know, file print, I get this. PDE dub plugin will damage your computer. And then if you say, well, whatever, I'll try to print anyway. What you then get is uh, this. Inkjet 1 that drive will damage your computer. And it doesn't print. So nothing's printing. See if it helps is to run a uh, cocktail. You know, basically give the entire system a, um, uh, a scrub down here, you know. So, um, you know, you can remove all your all your caches, but then right, you know, right into the printing uh, cups files, you know, get rid of the data. I'm going to get rid of the whole lot, you know. Right now, I'm just going to zap those caches. It takes a while, so I'm going to go get, get a fresh coffee and turn the video off, but it's just going to go away here and start cleaning up the caches, and hopefully this will solve the problem. Okay, none of my cocktail stuff worked or anything like that. I mean, it's good to clean things up once in a while. But over on the, uh, there's, you know, there's, just, there's people asking about this all over, but over on the Apple uh, discussions forum, a bunch of people had this question, like 136. I just clicked, you know, I have it too. It's a Kurt Long posted today, revoked its printer driver code signing certificates on the Mac OS on Apple. So that's like, you know, bummer. So he said, you know, try this. However, sometimes the fix produces that. So we're going to try that. We downloaded it here. Because those files, the PDE and the, those are normal files. So they're not like mal malicious in and of themselves. It's just that their certificate was withdrawn. Well, Alan Jones got, got a level 9 status here, 50,000 points, whatever that means. Sounds good, though. I mean, you know, the rest of them only got level 1 status or whatever. All right, so he seems to be responsible. So let's now install this puppy three hundred and twenty one megabytes jeez louise man it's like installing uh... indesign or something nothing like getting this on monday morning you know right boy oh boy boy hp's minutes like you know the rest of ours five minutes or whatever yeah, you know, a little bit uh, angry at HP right now, of course, but I have to tell you, one of the first printers I ever had here at Markswear was a uh, HP black and white, big old sucker, and that thing printed for years. I mean, we, we couldn't even, like, you know, stop it from printing. It just kept going. All right, well, we got this. A program tried to load a new system extension signed by HP. If you want to enable these extensions... Open security preferences, that's what we want to do. Yeah, I'll never forget that HP printer we had. Boy, that was a real workhorse. A workhorse. Yeah, we've got to click the little thing there. And then allow. Now it should, should continue here. Is that thing even moving? Okay, there we go. Moving along there. About a minute. It was about 10 minutes ago, it seems like. Well, it was five minutes ago right now. It's been about seven minutes now. All right, the installation was successful. Amazing. Now, let's see. We want to keep, well, you know, keep it for right now. I mean, you know, just in case. All right, now, the big moment of... All right, I decided to print out this little sheep here. Well, it wasn't that little, actually. No, oh, no, still... Still jive talking there, you know. My goodness. Let's try this first, you know. System press like printer scanner, select like print okay. System preferences. Oh, where are you? Here you are. Delete it from the list. And then add the printers back. Okay. Add the printer back. I think we want this one, not not to the other computer down there. Choose secure. What the heck, man? Choose secure, you know. All right. Let's see what happens now. Got a close up of Mr. Sheep there. Uh. 
Well, if you do print, you know, let's have you print it orientated correctly. Hey, it worked. It's printing. It's amazing. So that's fixed, guys. Uh, you got to get this here FTP download. You got to go through, you know, jump through a couple rings of fire, you know, say a couple of prayers, and then hopefully it'll work. Like you saw, the steps worked. Different errors than he got, but it worked, right? Okay. Thank you, uh, Mr. Alan Jones. Good job.